In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can make the butterfly girl shawl. It's a beautiful shawl using the butterfly stitch. But this time uh, in a triangle. So to begin, you'll have to chain 6. And then make a slip stitch with the first stitch and then chain three this chain three will count as a double crochet so turn your work and inside the circle make another five double crochet so we will have in total six double crochet six stitches to work with after making the five uh, double crochet just chain three and turn now we will begin the second uh, row by making two double crochet in the first stitch then three double crochet in the next one three double crochet again in the third stitch and now you have half of the triangle and, and it's time to Point the center of this uh, of your work so chain two and then make three double crochet in the next stitch again three double crochet in the next one And we will finish this row with three double crochet in the in the turning chain. Now chain three and turn. Now we will begin to make our butterfly the first row. So begin the row with two double crochet in the first stitch, then chain seven, skip the seven stitches. Basically, you'll have to make uh, your next double crochet in the last double crochet before the two chain two space then continue with the center point by making two double crochet in the chain two space chain two and again two double crochet in the same space Continue with one double crochet in the next stitch. So the first one after the chain two space Then chain seven
and then finish the row with three double crochet in the turning chain. So we finish the third row. Now to begin the fourth row, chain three, and again begin the row by making two double crochet in the same stitch. So in the first stitch, and continue with one double crochet in the next two stitches until the chain seven now chain seven and continue with one double crochet in the first double crochet after the chain seven from the previous row and make one double crochet in each double crochet to the center point and this in the chain two space from the center two double crochet chain two and again two double crochet in the same space Now continue with one double crochet in each of the three double crochet from the previous row until the uh, chain with seven stitches. Then chain seven. And make one double crochet in the first double crochet after the chain seven of the previous row. One more double crochet in the last stitch and finish the row with three double crochet in the turning chain. Now chain three and turn. So we are about to begin the row number five and we will begin the row as the same as the others with two double crochet in the first stitch. Then continue with one double crochet in each of the next double crochet from the previous round except the last one. In this last one before the uh, chain 7 we will make two double crochet. chain two and now yarn over and uh, we will anchor the double crochet on the fourth stitch between the uh, chain seven uh, the first stitch of the third row so of this solid row and we'll proceed the same in each rows where we will anchor the butterfly stitch now continue with two double crochet in the next stitch so the first one after the chain seven and then one double crochet in each stitch until the center point 
and in the chain two space from the center point we will make two double crochet chain two and two more double crochet in the same space And we'll continue the row with one double crochet in each double crochet from the previous row except the last one before the chain 7. In the last one, like I said before, we will make two double crochet. Now chain 2 and again anchor the double crochet in the first fourth stitch. So here in the first stitch we'll make the double crochet and be careful to uh, anchor the double crochet over the two uh, chain 7 from the previous uh, rows and now chain 2 again and in the next stitch in the next double crochet make 2 double crochet continue with 1 double crochet in each of the next three stitches and we will finish this row with three double crochet in the turning chain chain three and turn so here they are our first two butterflies now we are about to begin the row six and the row six will be a solid row so after each row um, in which we finished the butterflies uh, motif we will make a solid row and we will begin this row by making one double crochet in the first stitch so not two and one double crochet in each stitch so here we are I made one double crochet in each stitch and I am right now at the center point and in the center point on the solid row we will make only one double crochet chain one and one double crochet in the chain two space and then we will continue with one double crochet to the end of the row ending the row with three double crochet with two double crochet sorry in the turning chain so this is the end of the row six we will begin now the row 7 and basically we will begin the set of rows that we will repeat until the end of our project. So we will repeat the rows 7, 8, 9 and 10 until the end of our project depending on how big you want the, your shawl to be. So we will begin this row with two double crochet in the first stitch, then chain seven. Skip the next seven stitches and make one double crochet in the next one. And 
and continue with one double crochet in the next six stitches So we will have 7 double crochet in total after chaining 7. So between the butterflies we will have always 7 double crochet. Now chain 7. Skip the next 7 stitches until the last double crochet before the center point and in this double crochet make one double crochet then in the chain two space from the center point two double crochet chain two and again two double crochet in the same space Now continue with one double crochet in the next stitch. And we will repeat the procedure and the pattern of the uh, other side of the triangle. So chain seven, skip seven stitches. And in the eighth, we will make the first double crochet. and one double crochet in the next six stitches now chain seven and we will finish the row with three double crochet in the turning chain And this is the end of the row 7, now chain 3 and we will begin the row 8. Begin the row with 2 double crochet in the first stitch, then continue with 1 double crochet in each double crochet from the previous round until the uh, the chain 7 basically on row <clears throat> on row 8 we will follow the row 7 so we will make a double crochet in each double crochet of the previous round chain 7 when we have a chain we have a chain 7 on the previous row so now I just chain 7 and I will continue with 1 double crochet in each double crochet of the previous row. Then chain 7 again and again 1 double crochet in the double crochet from the previous row until the center point. So here I am at the center point and here I will make as we know 2 double crochet chain 2 and again to double crochet in the chain 2 space and on the other side of the triangle we will follow the same pattern so one double crochet in each double crochet from the previous row chain 7 where, where we have chain 7 on the previous row and we will end the row, as you know, with three double crochet in the turning chain. 
So basically we will end this row with five double crochet. So here I am at the end of the row eight and now it's time to begin the row nine. So chain three and then turn and two double crochet in the first stitch then one double crochet in the in each of the next double crochet until the last one before chain seven in the last one we will make two double crochet as you know on the row in which we finished the butterfly We will make two double crochet in the stitches um, in the stitches before and after the butterfly. So here in the last stitch before the chain seven, I will make two double crochet. chain two and then anchor the last the next double crochet in the fourth stitch of the row six if you want you can uh, mark the stitches so the first fourth stitch between the butterfly between the chain seven on the solid row just to be easier to know where to anchor the uh, double crochet now after finishing uh, the butterfly so after this uh, double crochet in the first stitch i just chain two then two double crochet in the next stitch and one double crochet in the next double crochet until the last one before the chain seven so here in the last one, as you know, we will make two double crochet. And basically we will repeat this procedure until the center point. And until the end of the row, we will repeat making our and ending our butterflies. So this is the end of the row nine now the row 10 we will will be a solid row so we will have to make one double crochet in each stitch and we will begin this row so on every solid row uh, every solid row will begin with one double crochet in the first stitch so not two as uh, on the other one and another difference on the solid row is that in the center point we won't make two double crochet chain two and two double crochet in the chain two space we will make one double crochet chain two and one double crochet so basically this is the difference these are the differences uh, that uh, we have to have in mind on the solid row so just making one double crochet in each stitch and continue and repeat these uh, rows from 7 to 10 as long as you want depending on how big you want your shawl to be and then you can add uh, an edge on it in the shawl from the picture i just made a shell stitch hope you like it and to the next time